Here we will discuss about light dependent resistor or LDR and also we will try to cover basic working principle of LDR. Light dependent resistor is also known as photoresistor. A light dependent resistor that is LDR or a photoresistor is a device whose resistivity is a function of the incident electromagnetic radiation or simply light. That is why they are light sensitive devices. They are also called as photoconductors, photoconductive cells or simply photocells. They are made up of semiconductor materials having high resistance. There are many different symbols used to indicate an LDR. One of the most commonly used symbol is shown here. The arrow indicates light falling on it. Now come to the working principle of LDR. A light dependent resistor works on the principle of photoconductivity. Photoconductivity is an optical phenomenon in which the material's conductivity is reduced when light is absorbed by the material. When light falls, that means when the photons fall on the device, the electrons in the valence band of the semiconductor material are excited to the conduction band. These photons in the incident light should have energy greater than the band gap of the semiconductor material to make the electrons jump from the valence band to the conduction band. Hence, when light having enough energy strikes on the device, more and more electrons are excited to the conduction band which results in large number of charge carriers. The result of this process is more and more current starts flowing through the device if circuit is closed. And hence, it is said that the resistance of the device has been decreased. This is the most common working principle of LDR. Now, we will try to give you some idea about characteristics of LDR. As we told earlier, an LDR is a light dependent device whose resistance is decreased when light falls on it and that is increased in the dark. When a light dependent resistor is kept in dark, its resistance is very high. This resistance is called as dark resistance. It can be as high as 10 to the power of 12 ohms and if the device is allowed to absorb light, its resistance will be decreased drastically. If a constant voltage is applied to it and intensity of light is increased, the current starts increasing. This figure shows the resistance versus illumination curve for a particular LDR. Photocells or LDRs are non-linear devices. Their sensitivity varies with the wavelength of light incident on them. Some photocells might not at all respond to a certain range of wavelengths. Based on the material used, Different cells have different spectral response curves. When light is incident on a photocell, change in resistance to take place, while it takes one or more seconds for the resistance to rise back again to its initial value after removal of light. This phenomenon is called as resistance recovery rate. Also, LDRs are less sensitive than photodiodes and phototransistors. A photodiode and an LDR are not the same. A photodiode is a PN junction semiconductor device that converts light to electricity, whereas a photocell is a passive device. There is no PN junction in this, nor it converts light to electricity. An LDR only changes the conductivity of the path for electricity depending upon the light falls on it. Now, let us come to different types of light dependent resistors. Based on the materials used, they are classified as intrinsic photoresistors and extrinsic photoresistors. Intrinsic photoresistors. These are made of pure semiconductor materials such as silicon or germanium. Electrons get excited from the valence band to conduction band when photons of enough energy fall on it and number of charge carriers is increased. Extrinsic photoresistors. These are semiconductor materials doped with impurities which are called as dopants. These dopants create new energy band above the valence band which are filled with electrons. Hence, this reduces the band gap and less energy is required in exciting them. Extrinsic photoresistors are generally used for long wavelengths. Now, 
we will try to give some idea about construction of a photocell or LDR. The structure of a light dependent resistor consists of a light sensitive material which is deposited on an insulating substrate such as ceramic. The material is deposited in zigzag pattern in order to obtain the desired resistance and power rating. This zigzag area separates the metal deposited areas into two regions. Then the ohmic contacts are made on the either side of the area. The resistances of these contacts should be as less as possible to make sure that the resistance mainly changes due to the effect of light only. Materials normally used are cadmium sulfide, cadmium selenide, indium antimonide and cadmium sulfonide. The use of lead and cadmium is avoided as they are harmful to the environment. Now we will discuss about applications of LDR. LDRs have low cost and simple structure. They are often used as light sensors. They are used when there is a need to detect absences or presences of light like in a camera light meter, used in street lamps, alarm clock, burglar alarm circuits, light intensity meters, for counting packages moving on a conveyor belt, etc. Hope you got an overall idea about light dependent resistor. Thank you.